In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NHL games happening on January 19, 2023 and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NHL games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer anywhere from one betting pick a day up to 10 betting picks a day and much more. Now let's get started. Nashville Predators vs. St. Louis Blues The Nashville Predators have been up and down as of late, but find themselves in the thick of the Central Division playoff push, and on Thursday, they'll look to gain ground as they battle the St. Louis Blues, who sit just a point behind them in the standings, meaning that they'll both be desperate for a win in this one. Both teams are certainly dealing with their injury issues, but have plenty of veteran talent that can still lead the way, and in a game that will feature a playoff atmosphere for a Central Division clash, fans should have their eyes glued to the screen. The Predators are 4-1 in their last five games following a win. The Blues are 5-2 in their last seven versus a team with a losing record and 15-7 in their last 22 games playing on two days rest. The under is 5-2 in Predators' last seven overall. The over is 21-8-2 in Blues' last 31 overall. The Predators are 1-4 in the last five meetings. The home team is 27-12 in the last 39 meetings. The favorite is 33-15 in the last 48 meetings. The Predators certainly have a massive edge in goaltending thus far in 2022-2023, with Juice Saros being a Vezina contender, but unfortunately, they've struggled in recent times against St. Louis, meaning this one will be an incredible class with two desperate teams. In the past 39 meetings between division rivals, the home team has come away winners in 27 of those, with the Blues also holding a 4-1 mark in their past five overall meetings. The Nashville Predators are a hard team to trust, as right when you're ready to think they're turning the corner, they fall apart. The St. Louis Blues are well-rested, and they have a clear edge on the offensive side here, so the St. Louis Blues money line is our full-game side pick. The Predators, who allow only 2.89 goals per game, should limit the Blues offense with Roman Josie, Ryan McDonough, and the rest of the defensive unit creating turnovers in the defensive zone and limiting shots on the net, allowing goaltender Juice Saros to make plenty of big saves. The Blues should eliminate the Predators offense that has only scored four goals in the last two games with Justin Falk, Cal Rosen, and the rest of the defensive unit forcing turnovers in the neutral zone and defensive zone while goaltender Jordan Bennington makes plenty of big saves. This will be a low-scoring game with both defenses stepping up. Under the projected total is our full-game total pick. Tampa Bay Lightning vs. Edmonton Oilers The Tampa Bay Lightning face the Edmonton Oilers in a matchup between two of the league's best teams. The Lightning have a 28-13-1 record which is third in the Atlantic Division while the Oilers have a 25-18-3 record and have four wins in a row. Both teams are looking to continue to gain ground in their divisions and the upcoming game should be a great one as a result. The Lightning are 21-7 in their last 28 overall. The Oilers are 2-6 in their last eight home games and 4-0 in their last four overall. The under is 2-0 at three in Lightning last five road games. The over is 18-6-2 in Oilers last 26 overall. The Lightning are 2-7 in the last nine meetings in Edmonton and 5-2 in the last seven meetings. The favorite is 10-3 in the last 13 meetings. The home team is 19-7 in the last 26 meetings. This is going to be a great game between two of the best teams in the league. The Lightning look to win on the road but the Oilers have won four consecutive games and look to step up on their home ice. The Oilers, who average 3.67 goals per game, should create plenty of scoring chances with Connor McDavid, Leon Dreisaitl, and the rest of the forward unit carrying the puck into the offensive zone and creating open shots with great puck movement. The Oilers should also limit the Lightning offense with Darnell Nurse, Cody Sessai, and the rest of the defensive unit creating turnovers in the defensive zone and limiting shooting lanes, allowing goal goaltender Jack Campbell to make plenty of big saves. The Tampa Bay Lightning are in one of those grooves where the winds pile up, and you shouldn't bet against them when they're rolling. However, the Edmonton Oilers are a good hockey team and them at home with the rest advantage while getting plus money is hard to turn down. The Oilers have had success at home against the Lightning, so the Edmonton Oilers' money line is our full game side pick. 
This game matches up two of the best offenses in the NHL between the Oilers, who have scored the top five most goals in the league this season. The Lightning lead the league in expected goals this season, generating a ton of chances and capitalizing on many of them. The Oilers' defense has struggled at many points of the season and should give up plenty of goals to the Bolts. McDavid, Dreisaitl, and Edmonton's offense have been fantastic as well, and although they're good, Tampa's defense isn't as incredible as it's been the last three years. The Lightning are on the second half of a back-to-back -back tonight, so I expect they'll give up a few plays due to fatigue that results in goals for the Oilers. Additionally, this game has the top two power play units in the NHL. Both teams have trended over this year, with the over going an impressive 30-13-3 in Oilers games, 7-2-1 in their last 10 games, and a perfect 5-0 in their last 5 games. The Bolts have also trended over this season, with the over going 19-18-6 in their games this season. I expect those trends to continue tonight in a high-scoring affair. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Washington Capitals vs. Arizona Coyotes the Washington Capitals face the Arizona Coyotes with both teams looking to improve from difficult seasons. The Capitals have a 24-17-6 record and with three losses in their last four games are in the middle of the Metropolitan Division. The Coyotes have a 14-25-5 record and with only one win in their last 10 games have fallen to the bottom of the Central Division. Both teams look to improve in their divisions with the season in full swing and the upcoming game looks to be a good one as a result. The Capitals are 8-1 in their last nine road games. The Coyotes are 19-41 in their last 60 home games and 19-47 in their last 66 overall. The over is 5-2 in Capitals' last 7 road games. The under is 5-2 in Coyotes' last 7 overall. The Capitals are 3-7 in the last 10 meetings in Arizona. The road team is 5-2 in the last 7 meetings. Arizona's only won one of their last 10 games and this won't be an easy matchup for them against a really solid Washington team. The Coyotes have been a bottom 6 team in the NHL on both both ends of the ice. I don't expect them to be able to score on a decent Caps defense while Ovi and the Caps offense should be able to score easily on a Coyotes defense that has given up the third most expected goals in the league. The Washington Capitals have been road warriors these last few weeks, and they should be licking their chops here. The Arizona Coyotes just don't know how to finish games, and playing at home hasn't helped them, dating back to last season. I give the Caps a significant edge in this game on both ends of the ice, so the Washington Capitals to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Arizona has one of the worst defenses in the NHL and I don't think they'll be able to score much on the Darcy Cooper and a solid defense for the Caps. Additionally, even though the Coyotes have given up a lot of scoring chances, Carol Vegmelk has actually been pretty good in goal. In their bit of a slump that they are in right now, the Capitals have struggled to score and I think Vegmelk should be able to limit the goals they put in the back of the net. I don't expect a whole lot of scoring in this game, which has also been the case in the first matchup this season between these teams. Under the projected total is our our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyze. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.